Hello everybody, Grace and Blazer. We're back with more My Little Blacksmith Shop. This is the brand new alpha version, 008. This just came out by uh, Noble Game Studio, and I think you can get it if you pledge a dollar. The patrons already got it. And then it says it comes out to everyone on the 7th of July, so just in a day or two here, whenever you see this. Uh, but there, I don't know what all the new changes are. Obviously, we have a brand new splash screen. I have been watching this game for months. We had a series back, God, I think it ended back in May when we had done just about everything we could do. And uh, the man himself has said he's been working on an update for quite some time and wanted to make it the biggest update yet. So let's go check this out over here. Very first thing, we have a difficulty setting. Oh, all we can choose is normal. All prices are average. Customers are patient. Individual resource respawn every in-game 24 hours. Ooh, individual resource. And the day cycle is 15 minutes. All right, let's do it. Now, the very first thing I'm going to have to do is set up my graphics because I know that's always what you have to do in this game. Never mind. It seems that my stuff was saved. So I guess I didn't really have to mess with anything. We have a bed over here. Oh, oh, whoa. Holy crap. This room looks way different. Oh, look at this. Look at this cheese and stuff. Can I pick this up? Oh, you sure can. There's cheese and an apple. Is that a flagon of mead? Or a tankard, perhaps? You can pick that up as well. We eat very healthy. Apples and mead. Got some potion bottles over here. Oh, you can pick up everything. I'm going to screw this whole place up. A pumpkin. I think that's a cooking pot. We got some artwork. I don't remember any of this being here before. We have this book over here as well. And then there's our little tutorial. <laughs> I assume the buttons are all the same. Over here in the main shop area. We've got the, wow, there's a lot of displays over here now. A reworked, oh, it, it's kind of reworked area. Look at this, we got a saw up here. Can I grab the saw? You can still jump, so that's cool. How about all this? Can you turn this on and off, I wonder? You can pick it up. Oh, you can pick it up and put it wherever you want. We got a clock now. Hey, wow, the time moves really fast, really fast. Oh, it saved my progress. 111,000 smackaroonies, and it saved everyone that bought stuff. This is cool. I didn't know if it would save our game or not. Look at the money we were making, baby. Making iron stuff the last time, and here's our area. What, what in the hell? Oh, we got, a, we got a sweet glowing horse. Look at this. Is that an archway over there? Ooh, I wonder what that is. Let's check out our glowing horse. Look at this. We got like a... We got like a, a wagon and stuff like that. This must be for hauling the resources. Horse idle. Oh, it's looking at me. Oh, it's like our golem horse. Yes. You beautiful striped horse creature. Left click. Oh. Oh, horse following. Horse following? You gonna do anything? Oh! It does follow you. Oh, there's like a giant pillar in the middle of town. Or, well, not middle of town, but the middle of our, uh, our backyard over here. Oh, that's awesome. The horse follows you. So, what do I do with the horse? I see it says copper hammer down there. I think that this, yep, right over here, allows us to select our different items. Uh, I'm pressing one. That's not really doing anything. What is that right there? Do you see that? Are you going to follow me everywhere, horse? Oh, you sure are. Let's check this out. Is this a thing? What is this? Oh, it's like a knight. It's like a knight over here. It, is there anything I can do with him? Nope, doesn't appear to be anything I can do with him. I guess he's just hanging out for right now. Ah, my horse is stuck. All right, so holy crap, there's already a ton of new stuff. I'm gonna put you on idle because we need to we need to look at like the town and stuff like that too. Oh my god. Oh, we're gonna be here for a while, checking all this stuff out. All right, so we got a new pillar over here. What does this pillar say? Credits. Epic Games. HIO. Oh, my patrons, everyone that generously donated. Epic Asset Store. YouTube content creators. Bug testing team. Music. And thanks to everyone that played the game. Well, thank you for making the game. This is a really cool game. Now, what we don't have is any of our items. It looks like... Oh, what is this? What is this back here? Oh, it's the smelter. Oh, my... I can't believe I almost freaking missed this. So, if you remember, we would take uh, raw resources. Oh. Oh, I'm like... I'm like... I, I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself here. The people, oh, so those are the people now, the townsfolk. They look a lot better. Here's our logs. Okay, I got it. So we can mine our own stone now. So then the question, I guess, is where is the stone at? Oh, it, sh it saved my shop name. No time for BS. Right over there. All right, fantastic. I didn't know it would do that. 
All right, so where's all the where's all the stone and stuff at? Where's all the ore? I wonder if it's way out back. It probably is. Yeah, there's a, there's new models for everyone. Everyone looks way better over here. Look at this. We got. Uh, I think they look better. It looks like better shading or something. We got some neighbors over here. I don't know what's going on now. We used to be in another house, if I remember correctly. Yeah, there's a dude over here. There's a little well going on. It's gonna be nighttime by the time I get done with all this, but I really want to check all this out. Let's find out what's going on over here. There's coats of arms over here. Is that a basket of apples? I can't seem to grab it or anything like that. Oh, hi, hello, hi. Is this like a what is this? What is this? Hold on. Can you... What do you do here? Look at all these grips and stuff like that. Like, do you buy them? Can you buy stuff here now? Like, there's a shop that sells the grips and stuff like that? Yeah, look at this. Common wooden two-handed grip. All over here. We got some boxes over here. So, like, if I take this, will it charge me? I don't... It doesn't... It's not doing anything yet. I just took this dude's rare pole arm. I mean, I can't just I can't just be allowed to steal it. There has to be some sort of buying system over here, I'll bet. This dude's got a gun behind his freaking counter. Now that right there, that right there is caution. This guy over here is a cautious man. I don't know. I came in, I wrecked this dude's shop, and then I left. I feel bad about the things I've done. But not too bad. So we wow, it gets really foggy out here at night. Holy god. I like I can't see anything. Hold on, let's go back to our blacksmith shop. Probably get some shut eye. And then tomorrow we'll see if we can find some resource nodes and stuff like that. Hold on, we're crap. Hold on, we're still closed, everyone. We're not open yet. I Gray still needs to figure the game out here. There's been so many changes. Alright. It is a beautiful new day. Wow, that sun is blinding. Holy crap. The sun coming up big time. So let's go out here real quick. And if you remember, it looked like there was an archway over here or something. I kind of just want to head this way and see what we find. If there's like a mine over here. Oh, is that a log? It is a log. It's just laying there languidly. Not looking impressive enough for my taste. Ah, the forest is still so foggy. Just like it used to be. Oh, the fog is real, boys. Whoa. Oh, there's something over here. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, what happened? What happened? Oh. Like, I thought I, I thought I teleported somewhere or something. That was weird. Oh. It's a mine. Yes. Look at this. Oh, wow. There's, like, glowing crystals down here and stuff. What does it all mean? Hold on, I'm going, I'm going deep inside the mine, boys. I don't even know what, I don't even know what's going on down here. Look at this. Wow. He has been hard at work. Oh, a little lantern here. Yay. Oh, I found a crystal. Look at this. I found a, I found the dark fear crystal. It's down here in the mines. Also, look at this. There's different veins and stuff down here. There's a tin vein. Oh, an adelite vein. We need copper. Look at this. All right. We need to figure out what we have to do to start mining this area. What else is around here? What is this over here? There's coal? Coal? Huh. All right. Okay. Wow. This is more coal? Yep, more coal. And then more tin. And I'm assuming that's more coal over here. Yeah, it sure is. All right. Here's what we're going to do. Let's go ahead and grab the crystal of evil right over here. We're going to bring this back to our house and we have to find uh, like a pickaxe or something. Uh, there may be one around here. Maybe I'm just missing it. Wow, it gets, it is really hard to see when you grab the friggin' fear crystal. Oh, I can't see a thing. All right, let's get out of here. See if we can find a way to start busting up all this ore because I want to start building stuff like from scratch. Like, I, I don't want to have to buy it. I want to build it from scratch. That'd be so cool. Oh, we got another crystal. We got another crystal over here. Oh, this is an unknown crystal. That was odd. I remember there being a crystal in the, uh, in one of the torches. I thought it was the back torch, but this torch had a crystal over here. All right, what I'm going to do 
is we'll make a couple of items real quick just to kind of see if if anything is new and unusual and then I got to see if I can figure out a way to get back there and start utilizing that uh, all the different ore and stuff like that all right I'm gonna go ahead and buy I'm gonna go ahead and buy a couple of ingots let's go ahead and buy some uh, some grips as well I'm gonna buy like 10 10 of each I would say I think there's a fancy polearm grips now too yeah there was the last time there we go like that and then we'll do some guards and we'll get the um, we'll get the third version of the guards we'll get like 10 of those and then we'll get some of the two-handed guards over here place the order there we go go ahead and pick this up and throw her inside over here well, there goes the crystal I'll pick you up in a little bit. I totally forgot that the crystals go flying if, like, anything goes ahead and touches them. Go ahead and bring this over here because a lot of this... Uh, a lot of this... Oh, my God. Look at the mess I made. Um, okay. Let's put the ingots on here first. I probably should have uh, bought, like, a separate, a separate box for the ingots because I remember we used to take the ingot box and just put it on the fire over here and then just heat it up that way. As usual, Old Grey grabbed a friggin' pole arm and things went flying into the stratosphere. So now there's just bits and bobs all over the shop right now. Like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna clean it up. <laughs> Look at this stuff go flying. I'm gonna clean it up eventually. It's just gonna take a while. Man, we got grips and oh man, we got all kinds of stuff over here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get this set up a little bit better. But for right now, let's go ahead and try something real quick. So let's uh Let's go ahead and hit our bellows over here, whatever this thing is. Yes, pump the fire. Stoke the fire good and strong. Read first. Okay. I remember all that. There we go. So now we have heated iron ingots. So if we bring these over here, for instance, and then we go to Z, we could have blunts, blades, shields, or axes. Okay. So I guess let's go ahead real quick. We'll open up the shop for like a day and we'll take some of the uh, of the shop, you know, of the different orders and stuff like that and kind of see what happens. Look at how far this stuff went. There's two handed grips all, all the way over here. Who's going to buy from this place? All right. So there we go. Shops open. We'll see what we got over here for a little bit. Now, are these are these still? Yes, yeah, they're all cooled. Oh, we got one, boys. We got one. Pickaxe. A pickaxe? I've never made a pickaxe. I've never made a pickaxe. I didn't even know that was a thing. Uh, what does a pickaxe take? I have no idea. Oh, God. Oh. A miner. An initiate miner. Okay. Well, I probably should have thought... I probably should have practiced this first. In fact, we probably should have, uh... We probably should have, like, bought a bunch of cheap ingots and then messed from there. So... Oh, where's my hammer at? I don't have a hammer anymore. Okay, so those are blades. CTRL to show stats. Oh, okay. Holy crap. Copper. Wait a second. I used iron. Okay, I just looked it up. I guess that's a bug right now where all the different metals are showing up as copper. So hold on. Let me close the shop real quick so I'm not pissing everyone off. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make you anything. Shop's closed. Now get out. Shop's closed. A one-handed, yeah, whatever. You. That's interesting how people have like jobs and stuff now. What is this X over here? Look at this X. Go ahead and click on that. I don't know what that was. But uh, all right, let's mess around real quick with some of like the copper ingots. So if I put these ingots down here, now what does it take to make a pickaxe? Because I have never made a pickaxe. And we, I don't think we could make pickaxes before. So is that under axes? It must be under axes because that's a type of axe, right? So let's try three. So we've got three copper ingots here. Now, what do I get with this? Whoa. All right. So we get the, the double axe head. Oh, oh, crap. All right. So we get the double axe head. Now, does it turn into anything else or is that all it is? Ah, got it. Got it. Okay. So you have to... You have to heat the item back up, and then you can you can kind of mutate it like this over here. These things seem to cool off pretty fast. Like, I'm going to go ahead and drop this in here. 
But to me, it seemed like it cooled off very, very fast. Okay, so let's put this over here. So now, what kind of grip do we need on this? Does it show us on... I don't think pickaxes are on there. So let's try a two-handed grip. What'll that do? We'll put a two-handed grip on there. Will that go? Uh, oh, yep. Sure did. Okay, so now... Yes! So we can equip our own items. Ah, okay, good. So then I'll bet if we make ourselves an axe, uh, we can chop down trees and stuff like that. So, got it. Okay, so one for the hammer, two for the pickaxe, and I'll bet because we never made ourselves a hammer, that's why one doesn't show up. Oh, sweet. So you can make your own items and you can use them. All right, hold on here. Let's, um, let's get a bunch more copper ingots real quick. Okay, I got it now. I got it now. All right, smashy do this thing. Of course I do it when it's not on top of the on top of the smelting thing over here. All right, so I feel weird by the fact that we can't see our own hammer. So let's make ourselves an actual hammer. Bring this over here. Now, can you make a hammer with one? Okay, no, you need two. So bring this over here. Now we can make a hammer. Got it. Okay, so, oh, not with the pickaxe. There we go. So let's go ahead and give this thing the old beady here. Now, I wonder if as you get better and better equipment, like different things happen. So what kind of hammerhead do I want here? Stats. Oh, it doesn't really say like control or anything like that. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like, I like the fourth one. Hold on. If we can get to the fourth one before this thing cools on. Yeah. I want that one right there. This one looks freaking leet. All right. So let's go bring this over here. And I think all we need is a one handed uh, grip for this like this. Yeah. There it is. One handed hammer. Okay. So now if we grab this. Ah. So now we walk. Yes. Yeah, see, now we actually have a hammer in our hand. Okay. That looks way better. All right. So now I assume we need an axe to cut up logs. So let's go ahead and heat up another one over here. Oh, I love, I love that they added like this part of the game where, you know, it's like you're a blacksmith, man. You should be able to make your own stuff. That would make sense. Okay, so let's go over here to axes. And now, what kind of different heads can I get? Obviously, there was only an axe and a pickaxe for that one. Um, oh, I guess there's only the single one because we made one of these before. It's actually on the ground, I think. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't seem any different. No, it's definitely not any different. Okay, got it. All right, I'm going to throw that in there for right now. We have the extra axe head right over here. Let's go bring this over here. Can I use a two-handed grip for this? I'm going to go use the ones that are on the ground. Oh, 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 oh. Hi, ho, 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 oh, no. Oh, God. Okay. All right. Yep, I screwed this up. I screwed the pooch on this one. Yes. And now we have a copper axe. Got it. Okay. Let's go mining, boys. Oh, you know what? We need our, we need our horse, too. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Shop's closed. We're going to close this down. We've done so much selling in the past that I'm really interested in checking out this new thing. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to go to sleep real quick so that it's a brand new day. I think that'll save our game as well. And then, yep, right over here. Okay, cool. Now, with the sun beaming up over the, over the countryside over here, let's go ahead and grab our, our freaking awesome golem horse thing. All right, horse. We need to name this horse. What are we naming the freaky glowing golem horse? We need to figure it out. All right, come with me, good sir. Now, are you, am I allowed to chop down any tree, I wonder? Or does it have to be certain trees? Like how we went over to the mine. Like, oh, oh, did you see that? Hold on. Can I do it again? I hit it, I hit it one time. That's odd. I hit it one time, it won't let me hit it again. Oh, I just got to aim high. What? Oh, tree down, boys. Yes. Oh, so cool. All right. So come on. Give me that log. Give me them logs. Give me them logs. Yes. We did it. Oh, yeah. Okay. So now you put the logs over here. Look at this. Put the logs inside of our... Yes! All right! Okay. Wow, this update was worth waiting for. Okay, so... Oh, hold on. Oh, we're not going to do this here. We're going to do it back at the shop. Because I think if you cut the logs, uh, it makes... 
it makes sticks or something like that. If I remember correctly, I don't know. It's been a while. All right, horsey, come on, keep going, keep going. We got stuff to do. It's interesting that the mine is in like this giant dead zone. Like, look at this. There's literally nothing here. All the trees are dead and sad. Can ooh, can I cut down this dead tree? It's that's weird. Right there, there's like a weird warp right there. It happened last time. Hold on. Am I allowed to cut down this tree? No, I can't click on that tree. Okay. But I figured out about the other trees, though. So, now, can you come into the mine with me, I wonder? That'll make this a lot easier if you can come into the mine with me. You can't, can you? All right, that's fine. We'll mine ourselves. It's no big deal. So, the, the number buttons are how you can select the different items. So, we can go from our hammer to our axe to our pickaxe. And clearly, there's a fourth thing that we can have. I just don't have it. So there was Adelite down here. I think that's what it's called. I wonder if it respawns different things over time, though. I didn't think about that. There may be totally different stuff down here now. So the Tin Vein. Ooh, the Adelite is still here. Okay. So. Oh, you know what it is? I'll bet you need an Adelite pickaxe to get the Adelite items. Totally makes sense. Okay. Got it. So, yeah. See, if I beat down this copper over here, where'd all the copper go? Ooh, you can do the coal, too. Oh, there we go. Oh, I'll bet you don't always get the right item. I got it. So sometimes the coal pieces will shoot out, but sometimes they won't. Oh, that is a pain in the ass. You have to bring, I see. So we're going to have to bring, like, a bucket down here. Because if, I, like, if we grab these one piece at a time... That is going to be absolutely freaking dreadful. Oh, that's going to be horrible. But, and then I'll bet as you mine, so now I mined uh, that, that resource out, the one copper resource and then this coal resource. I'll bet as we mine it out, it respawns and it could be something new and exciting. I got it. All right. So let's go ahead and put the little bit of coal over there. Uh, buddy, yep. Okay, I'm just making sure you're following me. Let's go back to our house. So we need to sell some stuff. So that we can start making pickaxes for all the different for all the different ore types. This horse is so cool. He'll follow you right into your back right into your backyard. I love it. Okay. So let's go ahead and grab one of these logs real quick. Now I know we only have like one piece of copper, but I just want to try this. Actually, we don't even have a piece of copper. We have a piece of coal. What does coal do? Like obviously you can start a fire with it, but like, so can I use this instead of the wood? I wonder. Hold on, let me put this in here. Oh, you can. Okay. So the coal, I'm guessing, is used a lot like the wood. So let's turn over to our axe here. And now I think that you can turn this into sticks. Yep. Common firewood. Right there. Got it. And then if you want, you can go ahead and shove firewood in there. And I think, yeah, see, now it's at 97%. And the coal's at 89%. Okay. So those items over there are fuel. Got it. And then if you put the ore in here, you'll you'll come out with your own iron ingot. Or, well, not iron, but I guess whatever style of pickaxe you have. But right now, all we have is a copper pickaxe. You know what? Real quick, let's go make ourselves... Let me see over here. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and do it. Let's go make ourselves... Well, hold on. If we do iron, it's 30 grand for that. Oh, that's right. We can't sell anything right now because the problem is, is that if we do, uh, it all turns into copper right now. Because remember, we um, we used iron, but it 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 turned into like a copper head. So we don't really want to mess with that yet. But let's try real quick. I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but let's go ahead and grab the tin. And let's see if the bug affects everything right now. Let's go ahead and turn this on over here. Because if I can get a tin pickaxe as well, I, I'm going to see if the tin pickaxe can not only pickaxe copper, but also tin, for instance. So, like, you only need one pickaxe is what I'm saying instead of having, like, one of each. I would assume that's how it is. You know what I mean? Like, the, they get harder and harder. Over here to the hammer. Oh, hold on. Before I do anything, let's make sure that we are on axes because that's what we're going to want. So let's go ahead and give this thing the old beady right over here. It'll turn into an axe head, but we want the second one. So, oh crap, axe head just went flying. Get back up on here. Get back up on here. Uh, there we go. Yeah, see? Copper pickaxe head. Huh. All right. All right, we need a crate. So I'm actually stealing my neighbor's crate. Didn't we used to have crates? 
over in the blacksmith shop. I feel like we used to have our own crates, and I didn't have to steal this other poor guy's crate over here. But like I said, I do not want to head into the mine and have to, like, piece by piece bring all of the ore out. That is going to get real old real fast. So we're going to... There's a ladder over here, too. Can you go up this? Oh, what was that? Oh, I'm grabbing pole arms from behind it. I guess not yet. I'm not really sure. Like I said, we can come back to it. But for right now, let's go ahead and grab this box over here. All right, we're back over here at the mine. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're getting some copper ore now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we're getting dat copper ore. We're getting dat copper ore big time. Oh, I see how it is. Sometimes the copper ore falls into that little, uh, that image there, and you can't see it. All right, so this time, this time, I've got a box with me. So we're going to throw... I want to do this because I want to be able to say that, you know, at the very least, we made one item. Even if there's a couple of bugs right now with the new update, it's still amazing. And I want to at least make one new item. So let's go ahead and grab all this. Oh, yeah, this is going to work perfectly. Yeah, grabbing one of these at a time would make me want to friggin' shoot myself in the face. So here we go. Put all that in there. Now, as long as I... <laughs> really? Really, game? Oh, I hate you so much sometimes. Come on, get in there. What is with this? How come everything always loves to go flying on me? All I want to do, all I want to do is put some ore into this freaking box and have it go with us for the moment time. All right, there we go. Grab that. Now, don't shuffle everywhere. All right, whatever. We still have several pieces in here. One piece of ore went flying. Let me see if I can bring this back to the horse without losing it all. Oh, no. Okay. All right. We're down to two. We're down to two copper ores over here. That's fine, though. Two's better than zero. Oh, my God. It's like you go ahead and you mine everything. And then you're lucky if you have 20% of it left when you're done. Is my horse still out here? I told him to follow me. But he's very, very, very slow. So I don't know where he is. That's fine, though. We'll just bring this back the old-fashioned way. I'll find him eventually. He's like a cat. You know what I mean? He shows up on his own all the time. I told you. There's our buddy right there. There's our buddy right there. All right, well, you you hang out there. I'll be back for you for right now. I just want to get this over to the smelter without losing it all. All right, here we go. We got it. So now, let's go over here. We should have... Yeah, I was going to say, we should still have some firewood. Let's go throw some firewood in here. I don't know how long you have to keep the fire going. I don't think it's too long. So we'll put that in there. I have several pieces of copper ore. So let's go ahead and throw the copper ore in there like that. Oh, we're going to make our very first... I uh, maybe we're gonna make our very first item. I hope okay. I think one piece of copper went flying eh, It's still in there. There we go. Okay. No other copper laying around. All right, sweet. So now Hit the button Bam, okay, and here it goes here it goes here it goes and then we should I think We should get copper spilling out into here. Now, yes Yes, oh freaking sweet that's awesome. Okay, I don't know what I want to make with this. Maybe we'll make a shield or something. Because I've never, uh... We have all the other items that we're going to need made out of copper. Alright, so we got copper ingot number one. I'm just going to put it... Actually, you know what? I'm going to put it right up here for right now. So we have heated copper ingot number one. I'm guessing it's one piece of copper ore per ingot. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Alright, yep, and there's our third one. So we got three out of the deal. Are these all still heated? They are. Let's go over here to our hammer. And, oh, you know what? Hold on. Let's, um, let's do a shield thing. I don't know what we can make out of this, but I'm going to go give it a shot real quick. I think. Oh, because some of them are cooled now. All right. All right. It's this trio right here of copper. We want to make sure to use this one so we can say that we made something out of wood that we harvested, copper that we mined, and, and we will have done it all ourselves. Okay, right over here. And then this copper ingot over here. All right, we got it. Okay. So now, I should be already set on shield. Let's go ahead and beat this up. Oh. Oh, you know what? I'll bet. Hold on. There we go. It's because uh, there's no shield item that can be made with three copper ingots. And th there it is. And it went right inside. Look at that right there. It went right inside of the water. So we got a shield rim that we made with copper that we mined. Not easily, mind you. And firewood that we chopped down. Oh, there's probably so much more of this game. 
Guys, hope you're enjoying my little blacksmith shop as we go ahead and discover more stuff inside of this really sweet simulation style game. Until next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.